Many times I generally get this question Pramod I am already a working manual tester or I aspire to be a manual tester what is the future that I have in especially in 2023 what are the areas that I basically have to prepare what are the things I can give it a try or if I am already doing a manual testing for one year two year three year five year right what are the next step that I can do what are the things I can do so that I can increase my salary I can get better opportunities what are the things I can do in 23 specifically what you can do right this is my plan and let's discuss about it very very well all right first of all make sure you expand your knowledge in the areas guys very very important especially for a manual tester right what happens is whenever you join a company right you are stuck with that 9 to 5 hour whatever you are learning at the job you will not learn anything new skill after that hour so this was a problem with me also when i have joined a one of the multinational company for like one or one year or somewhere right after 9 to 5 i used to play games on ps5 ps4 right i used to play games on ps there's no learning there's no communication increase there's no networking only 9 to 5 job of multi national company as a manual tester that was it that was my life what i learned is that i have lost almost like those 2 3 years where i have worked on it because i have not improved my skills not improved my learnings that's the super important point so you join a company and you're stuck with the knowledge that's the one of the important problem you know only office things you have not learned new skills still you are expecting a better opportunity which will not be possible for you because see why you are not getting better opportunities because you're stuck with that environment only only office gossips office knowledge now you need to ex expand your ela how you can expand promote you can expand by learning the email right i have learned it i have taken multiple courses online where how to write a proper email because see when i was in a multinational company right i used to write a very bad email my emails whenever i have written they always have some kind of problem spelling mistake even people are not able to understand whatever the three lines that i have written. so i have learned those concept from some of the mentors i have taken up some courses online so email writing course writing reports you have to share your reports with the qa lead uh, your product manager product owner right how to write a proper report what are the things that should be included learn these concept from the youtube videos or any other videos or any other templates that you see over on the courses also if you have to right invest in yourself now it's your time you have already got a job now you have to make double efforts apart from the job you have to add those skills that's what one of the important thing that i have done multiple multiple times and it works it will give you better salary better opportunity when you add more skills when you are working side by side because when you are not working right that's the only thing that you have is to add skills but if you are working now it's mandatory for you to add some extra skills so that you can have a edge as compared to other people add the score soft skills like leadership proactiveness right there are multiple soft skills that you can basically try those thing you can start increasing second important point is learn about the automation guys i have told this multiple multiple time if you are a manual tester for example for one year two year three year four year five year no matter how many years you have i would suggest you to start early as possible start learning the coding start reviewing pr start learning about the automation start learning web automation mobile automation performance testing wherever you are comfortable in automation right because most of the time most of the companies are going towards automation and these are the skills that you have to add now right now as a manual tester i would recommend everyone should start adding the skills guys many of you are afraid okay pramod i don't know coding what should i do see guys i have done multiple multiple times i have seen they are from a fresher they are from no it background they have switched to coding they have learned the coding right whenever you are taking a first step then only you will understand that coding is not that difficult that you have basically think about but there are other profiles in non functional testing for example performance testing security and other thing right which require tools and other things which are more important right so if you are a manual tester consider this like like that i am a manual tester and i am into the software industry now this is my step one now i can have multiple paths available to me i can go with the non functional testing for example security performance load testing i can learn about the automation in java python or i can learn more things related to devops or a developer things also so now it's your time to basically start exploring about more and more opportunities to get high salary and better opportunity so that's the important thing see i have told already that how to become an automation tester you know the topics you know the road map you know the project that i have to done i've done this multiple multiple time i would request you to go to testing academy channel just search for the keyword switch and i have created multiple videos how to switch from manual to automation 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 road map how to do it what is the topics that you need to learn what how many months it will take this will work trust me the only thing is which is stopping you to become an automation tester or 
learning the automation is you only. That's it. Third important point is network with the other people. Guys, as a manual tester, I would recommend you to start attending meetups. There are multiple meetups going on, online meetings, online conferences related to software testing, LinkedIn groups, Telegram groups. There are multiple groups. Join them, be part of them, but just see what are the different things people are doing. If you are working in a banking domain as a manual tester, search about what are the people in e-commerce are doing, how they are doing better, what are the documents they are adding. If you are moving, because in the end, if you switch to other, other company, right, probably you will be in the a company where e-commerce project is right, and you have a knowledge around this. So start improving your networking, work on your networking things, improve your communication skills. Of course, communication skills is not about only English, how you communicate with as a report, email writing and other things. That's also important. Keep up to date about your trends, guys. Now, I generally recommend for manual tester to start learning about Agile, Scrum Framework, Jira, Sapphire, CI CD tools, for example, Jenkins, Git. Those things are also kind of becoming a mandatory because what happens is these tools you will working with the developers or DevOps sometimes. I remember when I was a manual tester, there was many, many developers who basically used to ask me, do you know Git? Uh, can you push this branch? Uh, can you please deploy this? Right? Those things and all. If someone is giving you more opportunity on this, right? then why not learn these concepts as a manual tester i would recommend all of you to add api testing agile scrum sql knowledge jenkins knowledge git knowledge into your profile so that you are also improving you are also improving and moving towards the automation learning also right you are adding more skills you are becoming a more better software tester that's what you are doing make your life easy right for example when i was a manual tester i used to write python scripts to basically do multiple tasks if i have to do some excel processing i have to do some things right i have to basically log in even i have to do some manual task i used to write python scripts for it and it works very well i have got multiple multiple recognition due to the python scripts those python scripts so you can try out and trust me it works so these all things you have to do in 2023 let me reiterate increase your knowledge in different areas learn about automation network with the people improve your communication keep up to date with your latest trend that's what exactly the part of manual testers in 2023 whenever i'm saying manual tester it means software testers which right now don't have a knowledge around the automation that's it okay there's no business on this case okay thanks a lot for joining and if you are new to the channel i create videos around software testing test automation and the productivity i hope you have learned something new and if you are existing subscriber thank you for joining if you are a manual tester tell me in the chat how many months or how many years experience you have as a manual tester okay i will discuss a specific plan with you okay i'll see you in the next video Bye -bye.